Welcome! The following video will demonstrate how to program a GoControl Z-Wave wall dimmer switch into a GC2 security panel. All lighting products must be installed by a licensed electrician. Once installation is complete, you can begin programming. Ensure the panel and device are within 5 feet of each other. If needed, disconnect the panel from AC power and walk the panel over to the location of the switch. The panel will continue to run via the backup battery. Next, navigate to the GC2 Z-Wave Toolbox. Press the Services button. Then press Z-Wave. Press the wrench icon. Enter the installer code. The default installer code for the GC2 is 1561. You are now in the Z-Wave Toolbox. Z-Wave Devices may need to have past programming removed before they can be added to a panel, even if they are new. We do this by performing the removal process, which is also known as exclusion. To begin the removal process, select the Remove Devices button. The Remove Z-Wave Devices screen will appear. Press either the bottom or the top of the paddle two times. You will see a notification on screen that the device was removed. Press OK. Press Back. Now you can add the switch. This is also known as inclusion. Press Add Devices. The Add Z-Wave Devices screen will appear. Press the paddle once. You will see a notification on screen that the panel is querying device information. Do not exit this screen until you see the details for the switch display. Press back to return to the Z-Wave toolbox. If you have any remaining Z-Wave devices, you can add them now. Then, install the panel and all Z-Wave devices into their final locations. Lastly, complete a network rediscovery. During network rediscovery, the panel will recreate its Z-Wave routing table and optimize the mesh Z-Wave network. To initiate a network rediscovery, navigate to the Z-Wave toolbox, then press Advanced Toolbox. Press Rediscover Network. The panel will display a message that it is rediscovering the Z-Wave devices. Then the panel will automatically redirect you back to the Advanced Z-Wave toolbox. Note. The panel will continue to run the network rediscovery process in the background. Network rediscovery will take around 1 to 2 minutes per Z-Wave device. Z-Wave services may be unavailable until network rediscovery is complete. Press the Home button on the panel. The GoControl Z-Wave wall dimmer switch has now been programmed into a GC2 panel. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the Show More tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how-to videos, and our low-cost, no-contract alarm monitoring services.